Gilgarden UK and a construction planner, Mary Sanders, to find out about working on some of London's biggest building projects. My name is Mary Sanders. Um, I'm an assistant planner for BAM Construction. I live in Watford at the moment and currently work up at head office in Moorgate, but also work around different sites in London. The general responsibilities that I have in my job is doing programmes and planning out the work that takes place on the construction sites and also from the tender stage before we actually get the jobs um, and also probably towards handover where we go towards handover programmes. And A typical day in my job would be towards doing construction programmes and communicating with different people within our industry such as construction managers and quantity surveyors and also doing progress. So I'd go around site, I'd do progress photos, progress videos. We'll go into subcontracting meetings and also hold workshops and things. The biggest challenges I probably face in my work are, I would say, probably towards either my age, as I'm only 23. Um, I think people probably find it harder to take my word as gospel. Women that have probably inspired me in my life have probably been mainly my mum, um, due to her fully supporting whatever I want to do. Um, and she's always there for me and always happy to just accept what, whatever I feel like. I started off doing a BTEC in beauty therapy, um, did that, completed it, um, worked in a salon for a week and absolutely hated it. <laughs> Um, and just so happened to be offered a job as a document controller in BAM. Um, and from that point, I kind of, seven months into it, kind of looked, looked at construction as a whole and thought, well, I want to carry on in this, but I don't want to do document control for the rest of my life. So I went straight into planning and haven't looked back since. <laughs> yeah. I think it's also good to have female role models because a lot of the time there's only ever men and you can't necessarily see yourself working into the same position because it doesn't look like it's an option. If I was to give advice towards other young people coming into the construction industry, I would probably tell them to do it the same sort of way that I'm doing it. Maybe not exactly, but I would say that they probably, it'd probably be a good idea to do the um, vocational courses rather than the academic ones, do something specifically orientated towards construction, but also try and get a job, get a trainee position with a company, hopefully get someone that will support you through your work and through your college, um, and go and do those courses, but do them on a part-time basis so that you also get the experience off of site. Follow the debate on Twitter using the hashtag RealRoleModels.